Top 5 Strange and Bizarre Dead Bodies Number 5 the Luba. In May of 2007, a reindeer breeder and hunter named Yuri Kudi discovered the carcass of a frozen woolly mammoth calf in Russia's Arctic Yamul Peninsula. The carcass was named Luba. It was determined that the calf died approximately 42,000 years ago at the age of one month. She is by far the most well-preserved mammoth carcass in the world. The body's eyes, trunk, fur, skin and organs were all found intact. Number 4. The Montauk Monster is an unidentified carcass that washed ashore near the business district of Montauk, New York in July 2008. A woman named Jenna Hewitt, 26 of Montauk, and three friends said they found the creature near the Ditch Plains Beach. Number 2 on April 25, 1977, a Japanese trawler named Zhou Maro was sailing east of Christchurch, New Zealand when a strange, unknown creature became tangled in the vessel's trawl at a depth of 300 meters. The crew pulled the massive creature to the surface and discovered a foul-smelling decomposed carcass that reportedly weighed 1,800 kilos and was about 10 meters long. Number 2 in October 1932, two prospectors named Cecil Main and Frank Carr discovered a bizarre room while blasting for gold. After entering the room, the miners were surprised to see the mummy of a tiny man. The carcass was found sitting in an upright position with its arms and legs crossed. It sat perpendicular to the floor on a small ledge. The body was so well preserved that even the fingernails were visible. The head was covered in a dark gelatinous substance and the mummy appeared to have been preserved in a liquid. Upon its discovery, the carcass was given the name Pedro the Mummy. Number 1 the Panama creature refers to a carcass that was photographed near the town of Chiro Azul, Panama in September 2009. The rubbery beast was spotted by a group of teenagers crawling out of a cave. The kids said that the creature was hairless and had a leathery body with sharp teeth. It had revolting features, a snub nose and long arms. They also claimed that the animal approached them so they beat it to death with some sticks. Some accounts of the event say the kids tossed the body into a pool of water and left the area and later returned to the site and photographed the carcass. 